What's up ladies, welcome back to my channel. Today for you we're doing a Sephora haul. This is everything that I bought for the Sephora 20% VIB sale. All the things that I stocked up on and maybe a couple of splurges. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that little bell notification so you're notified every time I post a video. I do a lot of lifestyle, mommy, organization, and hauls. If you feel like depositing some positive energies in the universe, give your girl a thumbs up. I'd so appreciate it. I'll be linking everything for you in the down bar as well as my new website. If you want to see everything that I bought on Sephora for the 20% VIB sale, then just keep watching. Okay, you guys, so this is going to be a really quick video. I didn't get too much. Some of them are big ticket items. I think that's why I didn't get a lot because I was like, whoa, I didn't purchase much, but how come my price tag is so much? So I'm just going to show you guys. I didn't pick this one. I don't know why. It says BB Thickening Shampoo, Bumble and Bumble. That's going to be given away. I picked these two out though. The Fenty Foundation. I'm really, really curious. I want to see if they have my colors. Oh yes, there's definitely a color here for me. So I'm so excited to try that. And then I got another foundation one. It's the Marc Jacobs Shameless 24 Hour Foundation. So I'm excited to try that as well. Let's dig into the things that I feel like maybe aren't as excited. This is stuff I needed to stock up on. I just ran out of my Beauty Blender Solid. I absolutely love this stuff. I don't know what they use in this, but no nothing else works. Like no other soap I try to use anything else. I'm like, did you create this sponge so we could only use your soap? I'm just wondering because it's pretty much how it turns out. So I buy the Beauty Blender soap and I totally wouldn't if I didn't have to, but I feel like it's the only thing that gets it absolutely clean. So I love this stuff. It's the solid. Let's see if I can open this for you. So it comes with this little thing on top and then it has like a bar. So you kind of just rub your sponge on top of there. But Okay, so I got another Beauty Blender item, which is this BB clean it's got like the I think if this is the shampoo and then it comes with two beauty blenders I'm gonna open this okay so yeah so you open it it kind of looks like a shampoo so it's a liquid so this is new to me I was like I didn't want to try it because that one works so good but since it was 20% off and it comes with two of these sponges it was definitely worth it okay so another item I have a bunch of these but I wanted to stock up they're usually I think ten dollars or something and you get how many do you get of these 165 cotton sheets I've used so many and these are like the best. I mean, they have the ones at Costco and all those things and I'll use those if I have to, but I try to stock up, stock up on these because I use them in my eye area and I feel like, you know, your eye area is very sensitive. So I really like these. They're Shiseido, Shiseido, I think so. <laughs> I got the La Mer, the moisturizing cream. Anyways, I got the La Mer cream. I use this all the time and I use it under my eyes like in this space. That's how I try to conserve it as much as possible and I don't use it across my whole face and I'll use them on my neck and like in this triangular area here and across my nose because this stuff is expensive and I already went through the half size of this and I'm like, okay, I already finished it. I'm needing some more so I bought the big one and just bit the bullet. So I'm gonna continue to use this. I really wanna try the eye concentrate. I might go back and buy it. My birthday's on Wednesday, so I might have a good excuse. I really love this. And um, I'm gonna scoop some out and put it in the little one and I'll use that for um, my travel bag, which is good. Oh, another item. Okay, so this is new to me. This is the Peter Thomas Roth. These are eye patches and I've really been wanting to get some. Um, these are hydrogel eye patches with hyaluronic cloud. I have been wanting to try something like this. Um, I want to use these every day before I do my makeup. I see a few girls on um, YouTube doing that. So, oh, it has this little scooper. Let's see. Open it up. Oh, there are like little gel pads. You guys can see that. It's like gooey. Okay, well, I'm super pumped to try these. No, they don't really have a scent. I'm excited to try these. I will let you guys know because I've been wanting to try a Peter Thomas Rock. I usually use like organic stuff, um, but I just tried the Juice Beauty ones for the eye patches and you add water to them and then they rip. I'm just like, oh, I wish these work because I love the ingredients. I love what it does, but I'm not gonna keep using something if it's ripping and stuff. That just causes me bad energies. And if I'm using it in the morning, I just don't have time for it, okay? 
but um, there's another brand, I believe it's 100% pure. I've tried their eye patches and I really like those. So I'll probably try these and then um, probably use both of them depending on my mood. <clears throat> Sorry guys, if I sound a little stuffy, I have um, a little nasal thing going on here. So this item is also new to me. I use the SK2 and I'm about halfway done and I love it. It's the SK2 Essence. Now this is also Essence by Tatcha. Let's open it up. And this was $90, I think the other one was $100. So they're very pricey items. The Essence is a step, you wash, then you tone, and then you put Essence. And then you follow with your serum and your other stuff, whatever else you start putting on your face. But there's a process because this helps all of your other products absorb. So this is supposedly like more natural and all that good stuff. So I'm hoping this one works better. It definitely probably has chemicals in it, I'm sure. But um, this one has better ingredients than the other one. Ooh, how pretty. It comes in like this little pretty paper here. Oh my gosh, this is gorgeous. Look at this packaging, like so pretty. Okay, so this has like a little pouring spout thing. This is really pretty packaging. And I like the way this feels better. It's like very thick plastic. The other one's glass. So I'm really liking this. Okay, so I have only two things left. Um, the next thing is this Easy Bake by Huda Beauty. And I don't know if I got the wrong color. I think this might be too light for me. I don't know. But anyways, this is what the packaging looks like. I got pound cake. And... We'll see if it's too light. If it is, then I'll exchange it. But I'm really eager to try this. This looks really good. And the last thing that is definitely um, something that I wasn't expecting to buy, but I was like, you know what? It's 20% off. It's so cute. I just love Muschino. Muschino? I don't know if I'm saying that right. I don't know if I'm ever saying anything right. But I love how cute these little like spray bottle perfumes are. I was like, how cute will these look in pictures? So I got these and I can't wait to smell them. And I got the smaller ones because I've always wanted to buy the bigger ones, but this way I can try the little ones out. And that's it. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching my Sephora VIB sale picks. Let me know what your picks are in the comments below. If you made it to the end of this video, thank you so much. I truly appreciate you being here and supporting my channel. If you haven't done so already, subscribe, hit that little bell, give your girl a thumbs up. I'll be listing all of my products, including my website. And until next time, I'm always your girl, Lorna Marie. Bye.